one step at a time. will guide me. We've known enough grief this ten-day traveller. Don't be the cause of more. or potions. Hey, bother. No, sweetie. <sighs> How long until Roland shows off his thunder wave? Done. Depends. How many people are dumb enough to ask? <laughs> True. No helping it. You've had your share. Leave some for the rest. Lee and Roland would never admit it, but they take an arrow for the other. Also stab each other. Not sure what will come first. Thanks for cutting in. There might have been more than words if you hadn't. Again. We should have left by now. Damnish! Instead, we're just sitting here, practically begging to be attacked. Staying is a mistake. And what about us? There's every chance we've doomed ourselves by helping these people. We will end up fodder for some goblin's blade, all because Leah insists on helping every wounded foe we see. Our best chance to make it to Baldur's Gate is on our own. This place is lost. You are looking at Laroican's newest apprentice. Yes, that Laroican. The greatest wizard in Baldur's Gate. I've heard that name before. A young man, yes? Lives in Ramaz's tower in the upper city. The very same. Word in Waterdeep has it he's a bit of a cad. But you say he's an accomplished wizard. 
Of course he is. The greatest spellcaster along the Sword Coast. As if I'd settle for a lesser mentor. In that case, I'd very much appreciate it if you could arrange an introduction, should we reach the city. If it's powerful acquaintances you're after, you have to look no further than yours truly. Few can match me, in either magic or talent. In years to come, you will boast of this meeting, I can assure you. May we meet again in Baldur's Gate, my friend. I keep dreaming I'll wake up with my throat slit. May your sleep be more pleasant. Find it. Yes, of course. I heard what happened. Thank you for protecting the child. If the druids are this far gone, then it's not just goblins we have to fear. So we can risk violence here, or face it for certain on the road. Quite the choice, isn't it? It's good of you to offer. But there's a whole army of goblins out there. We'd need an army of our own to escort us safely to Baldur's Gate. And while I don't doubt your abilities, you're no army. There may be a way, though. Goblins are ill-disciplined. It's unlike them to organize so cleverly. Somebody must be leading them, bringing discipline to their ranks. Take out that leadership and they'll scatter. The Blade of Frontiers has done what he can to help us prepare for the journey, and we are grateful. But it'll be a short journey if the goblins still own the roads. By the Triad, there is only one correct answer. Refuse him, and we sentence these people to die. Everyone in this camp depends on it. Thank you. We'll be ready to leave as soon as you give word. Commander! Just Zevlor, Tilly. We're civilians now, remember? With respect, sir. Being a Hellrider is for life. They can't take... They can, and did. Avernus changed things. Steady.
It is, as they say, empty. used to think the goblins would kill us the second we set foot outside. But after hearing what you did at the gate, well, I still think they'll kill us. But at least we can put up a fight. <laughs> there's optimism and then there's stupid, hun. Plenty of us fell to monsters already. I don't see the rest of us lasting long out there. But if you're so sure we will, why not put a little gold on the line? <laughs> no, it's not. None of this is funny. But at least this way there's something to play for. Come on, what do you say? No? Shame. I thought you might enjoy a little fun. <laughs> Be safe out there, whatever comes your way. as ever. What have we here? There. Done. Again. Swing and swing and parry. And... and again. Swing and swing and...
No helping it. We're exposed now. Let's get on with it. What a day. Over here. Defender of the people. Ever onward.
back. Might be worth a look. But you're bloody getting some if you don't. Lads, for the love of all that is holy, I've never clapped eyes on your poor sister. Drop the act, hag. You was the last to see me, Rena. Just let her go. Please. You there? Please, I don't know what's come over these boys. I just want to go home. Stop this. We... We won't ask again. Careful. Don't trust a word out of her mouth. Our sister went to the hag, and we ain't seen her since. Hand over heart, I don't know their sister. I will gladly help you all look for her, though. Enough. Where is she? Sweetie, be careful! He's with the hag! Don't bloody stand there gaping. Get him! this to happen. Those poor boys were looking for their little sister, Marina, the girl who's staying with me. This is all my fault, but I made a promise. Marina begged me not to breathe the word if they came looking for her, and my word is my bond. That poor thing would be distraught. We can't let her know it would break her poor heart. I'd best get going, but please stop by my house. I'd like to thank you proper. Helpless old ladies. Was that normal? I reckon the sister's in trouble. We need to pay effort. A chill runs up your spine. You feel like you're being watched. The place has a quiet sense of calm. You can't see anything strange. Shall we?
this way. I don't want a crumb left on that plate, girl. Auntie Ethel, please. One more bite and this pie is going to come back up to say hello. Don't make me get the wooden spoon. You're eating for two, so get to it. Oh, if it isn't my hero. You took ages. Come in, come in. Feel free to relax yourself and have a cuppa. Gods, grant me patience. Eat up, Marina. I won't say it again. Beautiful, isn't it? It's my little refuge for the lost and hopeless. People in dire need travel from all over Faerun to see little old me. And I do my best us to help them. And you, Petal, well, you need a lot of help. That wriggler swimming in your brain juice is a bit of an inconvenience, isn't it? Quicker than you can say, yes, Auntie. What do you say? Want me to take care of the little bugger? My, I do like them eager. But know that I don't work for free. I expect payment up front. One of your pretty little peepers. I pluck it from your head. Kiss it for luck. Then back in it goes. Won't take but a moment. That is my price. Nothing more, nothing less. I'm afraid that's my business, Petal. It's nothing nefarious, though. I promise. Glorious. One moment. And she needs her real nails for this. Better. That human skin is fierce restrictive. Close that mouth, precious, lest you swallow a fly. Not many get to see a hag in all her glory. Consider yourself blessed. Now choose which I will it be. Right or left? You absolute idiot! I'm no Marina. Time to go.
I can just walk into homes now. This gets better and better.
with the Ness. Its entire body shakes. It ribbits erratically as if in pain.
next, I wonder. Take two. Let's try this way. Bless you like trash. Where's the rest of the lads at? Probably getting curled out their brains. I'm pretty much. Tribe? Tribe! Artifacts get trust me. I will. Let's keep going. And the drow? And the null norder arm clean off. So much for the flaming fish day. You ain't here. We sacked Joaquin's rest and left it to burn. Drow flinging magic. Noel snapping off heads. 
Inn's nothing but a pile of ash by now. Glorious. Bunch of prisoners got towed to Moonrise. City snobs mostly. But the flaming fist? Pile of smoking corpses. You ain't know the broken road? Meh. <laughs> I'll tell you real slow like, so you don't miss it. No. Like they've captured themselves a barn. Come, fill the front row. Hmm? Not what you care. What kind of you must? A new age is dawning with some confidence and trust. We have to see the druid out of this. It's a veritable plague. Bloody racket! Let's keep an eye out oh, and hope on. he's still drawing breath They're while we find him. Just a bit of fun. Boy, so much fun. Saluna. As if mingling with a horde of goblins wasn't bad enough. Let's do what we have to do, then get out of here. Saluna's a bad omen. Just look what's befallen her temple. Though, I'll grant it must have been impressive once, in all its profane glory. I wonder what happened. No matter. I'll breathe easier once we're clear of this place. Said you pass, you don't pass! Bloody racket! Oh, come on now. They're just having a bit of fun. Aye, so much fun that those thieves almost got past. We got them now, eh? And once the whelps start singing, we'll know who sent them. Aye, might be we'll pay a visit in return. That'll be some real fun. <laughs> This ruin's dedicated to Saluna. Here, the absolute <laughs> voice. Do you feel it her like burnt inside you? I only hear her through you, priestess. That's because... Now, here's somebody special. The absolute has touched you, hasn't she? Priestess Gut needs to touch you, too. Hold out your arm so I can mark your flesh. A priestess? One of the leaders, no doubt about it. Let's make her squeal. What's that? Tell your friend to keep quiet, or he'll lose his good eye. Ready for the fire, are ya? Maybe you don't need it. After all, you're special, ain't ya? Like me. 
She probes your mind, tangling your thoughts with hers. A familiar sensation. She too carries a parasite. Darkness seems to swallow the temple, leaving you with a vision of the goblin priestess receiving instruction from a handsome young man, one of the chosen. The vision dissolves away. You stand before the goblin priestess in the temple once again. Her faith floods into you, a tide of shuddering ecstasy. Her tadpole nestles within that mania. Secure, hidden. I feel you in there, digging around. Works both ways. And I saw some weird shadows swimming around in your head just now. Maybe I can help with that. Us true souls gotta look out for one another. With the Absolute's will, I can fix anything. Let's deal with this in my chapel. It's private. Don't want this lot interfering with true soul business. Oi! Priestess! We want the mark! Yeah! Unaware. Ain't we good enough for the Absolute? Do we want to turn out like that? Blissful idiots who thought they were talking to their god. Waiting around. Ready to clear your head. Don't want a crowd of gawpers. Everybody else needs to leave. Ready to clear your head. Whatever the Absolute tells me to. Don't worry, she loves you. I can tell. Don't want a crowd of gawpers. Everybody else needs to leave. Ready to clear your head? The Absolute will protect me. You don't stand a chance.
and I'm sure. this way. Some drow wizard in Moonrise want to look at you for. Certainly you won't be, cause he a beautiful. Day three. Again, again, make it squeal again. We're juicing it up. The beast came in here with those robbers, killed Dink and Mince too. Boss is thinking of serving it to the wargs. And it makes funny noises. We made it squeal. If you can't stand a bit of rough housing.
Oh, no. 